Hello and welcome to Video Revealed. I'm Colin Smith. Let's talk about something called screen tearing and why you shouldn't worry about it. All right, let's look at some examples of screen tearing. If you've paid attention to your screen, sometimes you see these little things come up and they might drive you crazy. Okay, so let's have a look. I'm playing this video. And, oh, what was that? I marked these out for you so you could see them a little easier. Right there, you see those little shifts. It's almost as if the picture is moved, torn is, is why they call it screen tearing. It's torn at that point. Let's look at a few more. You can see down there, right there again, a little on his back, a few more over there. I think you get the idea, and they show up in all of these places. Well, I've got good news for you. You won't see those when you output. These are only an anomaly that you'll see when the screen is playing back, not when you're exporting. The only way I could capture this was by hooking up a camera and pointing it at my monitor on my desktop system and recording that. You can see on the right hand side here, it, it's, this isn't a full picture. That's part of, of me recording that monitor. Uh, it was the only way to, to make it uh, show up. This is a problem with the, the GPU graphics drivers. So when the drivers are having a problem, that's when you see uh, screen tearing. I never care about it. Have you ever seen anything in my show of screen tearing? No, because I don't care about it. I now know what it is. I disregard it. Well, I knew about it a long time ago. So you just leave it alone. But a lot of people will panic because they'll look at their video and they'll wonder why this is happening. And maybe it, it's, it changes. So they'll see it and then they won't see it. And that drives them even more crazy. So I, I found the error on my, my Dell uh, Precision Workstation before I updated the driver. So while I was preparing this tutorial, I saw them on this laptop. Uh, and during that time, there were new drivers from NVIDIA. I installed them and guess what? Every example I wanted to show you on my laptop was gone. So the new driver fixed it. I didn't see them on my uh, laptop at all. So I went over to my desktop, which is a, uh, a different graphics card that has a different driver. Um, although it was the same monitors, the same 4K monitors I was connected to, when I, I tried the same example over there, same project, same clip, then I saw these examples I'm showing here. So it's a different driver. And I guarantee you, when a new driver comes up, they'll probably change. So it's not something that you have any control over. You can't go in and change a setting in your, your GPU or your graphics card uh, and, and not see these. You might not see them. In fact, I bet you wouldn't see them if you switched the, the uh, GPU that you're using. Some systems will allow you to switch between uh, CUDA and OpenCL or between the Intel drivers and NVIDIA drivers. Or if you're on metal, you might see this with some drivers. Same thing. There, it's all about GPUs because the graphics driver is another layer between the application like Premiere Pro and the output and there's no way to control it. So the good thing to remember is you'll never see these on export because they're only during playback on the screen itself. That's why I can't do a screen recording. I have to hook up my camera. So there you go, really, really simple, uh, but I bet you it will alleviate a lot of frustration and worry that some people are having um, that it's going to be in their export. And on that note, Here's what I would ever do if, if you're sitting there and you obviously haven't watched this tutorial and you don't know you're not gonna have a problem, just export, just try it. Way too many people encounter something and then instead of trying to export, they just drop everything and say, yeah, something's wrong. Try and export. Just try and export of the tiny little area. Hit an in point, out point, and then export that out. And I guarantee you won't see it. Hey, if you're new to the video revealed and you have found this informative, Take a moment and subscribe, please. It makes a big difference. If you want to support us some more, uh, like many of our, our 
PayPal customers, you can do that through PayPal. Uh, there's a, a button to donate in the uh, description of this video and on the front of the channel. And I tell you, I've helped a lot of people um, off of the YouTube channel that contact me either through our Facebook page or through uh, Instagram is becoming more popular, although it's, it's a lot easier for me to answer your questions uh, through Facebook. And um, I fix a lot of problems. And when I do that, lots of people uh, you know, tend to donate, give us a little bit, uh, but I'm here to help you. So, hey, till next time, I'm Colin Smith, and it's my job to make sure that uh, you're feeling okay about things like screen tearing that aren't going to be a problem when you export.